I want to ask you about emerging trends in Web3 that excite you the most. At the expense of beating a dead horse, I would say ZK. I think we've been talking about ZK for many, many years, but from a production capacity, it was kind of lagging. I think we're finally beyond that. And for what can you use a zero knowledge proofs at their current level of scalability? To give you an example, right, uh, to, uh, to interpolate this onto oracles, oracles need to update, right, as frequently as possible. The more an oracle updates, right, the more accurate of an oracle it is. But if an oracle update with snore signatures costs, you know, uh, 10 cents, and with a ZK proof, it costs a dollar, then the extra security you get from a ZK proof uh, negated by the Oracle update costing 10 times as much. Uh -huh. So it's, it's that original topic we touched on, right? Security versus cost kind of trade-off. But more recently, I should say consistently, zero-knowledge proofs have been getting cheaper and cheaper and cheaper both to generate a zero-knowledge proof, right, which requires a significant amount of hardware. There's a difference between someone at a hackathon creating something and using ZK proofs and it actually being like ready, you know, for a product. I'm a bit of a privacy nut. I think zero-knowledge proofs are an excellent way to do privacy. 